it's time to look at my love bug. This kind of Volkswagen go-kart is rare, and the movie nostalgia with it is even better. That's what's going to drive the price through the roof. I mean, come on, Disney's expensive to go to. I've only gone once. I paid almost three grand for Herbie. If he's not the one from the 1960s Disney movie, I just blew three fat stacks. Judging from the age, this go-kart's been around for at least 15, 20 years. But is it 40 years old? And that's really the question. Was it in the Herbie movie? The Herbie movies featured a full-size car, and this is a miniature. I'm not a movie guy, but I can tell this is a problem. I like to dream. I'm driving over to Old Town Adventure Park to meet Jenny Lynn. She's a Disney expert. I'm hoping she can tell me if I bought a real Herbie car and how much he's worth. Where did you get this? I got it at an amusement park auction for $2,900. The only reason I paid so much is because I felt that this was the only one out there. If you're going to find something from the parks, from the movies, from the events, this is the place that you're going to find it. I'm definitely excited to have this cool car. Everyone loves Herbie, especially Disney and Volkswagen fans. You've got a good product here. There's an old saying on Long Island. If you want Disney, go to Orlando. I've never seen a kit put together like this, so I'm thinking this might be pretty rare. This is not a kit-type item at all. I think you can count on maybe two being in existence, three at the very most. Just because something's rare doesn't mean it's good. Look at foot and mouth disease. This, to me, doesn't look like a 40-year-old go-kart. Is it possible that Disney, like, they kept up on maintenance, they gave it a couple paint jobs? You're talking about Disney, so of course. They're going to keep everything in tip-top condition. Mm -hmm. They're going to give it new tires, they're going to check the engine, they're going to give it a little bit of a paint job. So that could account for why it is in such good working condition, even though most likely it is a 40-year-old item. It's the right age, but why is my love bug so small? If this was featured in the movie, how come it's not a full-size car? This particular one came from Herbie Rides Again, the sequel to The Love Bug, and there is a dream sequence in the film where the bad guy is having nightmares about Herbie. So that is what this was used for. An authentic Herbie from the Disney movie? BB. So I paid $2,900. Am I going to make any money? I've definitely seen it in Disney on Ice. I've seen it in the parades. This is the one from the movie, yeah. which means that it is a rare item, has strong nostalgic value. Your market is the Disney fan. They're usually willing to pay big bucks for the things that they love. So I'm going to value this at somewhere between... Come on, little guy, let's see some big money.